I am Dramos from the Michael Tura Podcast Network. We are live here backstage, Miami, Florida, iHeartRadio Fiesta Latina, and I am joined by Luis Figueroa, yeah. Emily Estefan, and Gemini Hernandez. Yeah. My guest today, Fonseca, Woo. how you doing? I'm here with the one and only Gale. How you feeling? When we talk about culture and we talk about the word specifically community, what comes to mind for each of you guys? For me, I think that I've learned that when you leave Miami and when you leave to other places, whether it be in the United States or Europe, if you have Latin roots, yeah. you take that anywhere you go. We all feel the same. It doesn't matter if we come from one country or another, it's mm -hmm. diversity, you know, and, yeah. it's, and, and that's all about like our Latin culture. To me, community is where you grow up, your family, your friends, the people you kind of like see all the, all, all the time. It doesn't matter. They don't have to be like close to you, yeah. but it's like your people, you know? Right. We Latinos, we're known for opening our doors up to each other, yes. for being warm. I mean, it's not every day that you can walk into a place and yeah. hear somebody say, Bienvenido, corazón, como right. te ayudo? Latina. Este, hay, o sea, obviamente la comunidad latina nos une por sangre. Mm -hmm. Y también por cultura, porque todos enseñamos este, esa belleza que es ser latino. Yeah, yeah it's like, familia, familia. Right. Sí. You know, en el barrio, en Philly también tenemos una, we have a, um, a really, you know, concentration of Puerto Rican and Colombian and like that. That same swag that they have over here in Miami, yeah. they just, you know, they have winters and stuff. You right. know what I mean? <laughs> right. How we uh, communicate, how we share, um, I don't know, food, um, uh, traditions, uh, citizenship. Mm -hmm. That is community for us. Yeah. As a Cuban, yeah. you know, yeah. family mm -hmm. is always been a priority. Absolutely. You know, and mm -hmm. I think that the Cubans, when they arrived in this country, were made sure that their children spoke Spanish. My yeah. first language is Spanish. I speak Spanish very well. I'm yeah. very proud of that. And so do my children. So I feel like our culture has passed on their culture, their language, the traditions, mm -hmm. the food, just everything. Mm -hmm. And I'm very proud of it. And what about growing up? Let's talk about those neighborhoods that you grew up in. What, what are the memories that come to mind when you think about growing up? I grew up in Colombia, mm -hmm. Bogota. I grew up with a lot of uh, folkloric music, vallenato, and, but also the rock and the pop. So it was a mixture of everything. And, and uh, yeah, that was my neighborhood, like a, like a mix of, of, of everything. I grew up on Miami Beach, mm -hmm. which was a blessing and lovely. Yeah. And I feel like something that's often overlooked about our city is how close we are in proximity to so many islands mm. in these beautiful waters. Yeah. So for me, being able to be so connected to the ocean and, and surfing and like connecting to that portion of the earth has been a big gift to me about the city. It's amazing. We grew up more in El Campo, mm -hmm. so they had like I had a horse. You had a horse? <laughs> yeah, called Star, <laughs> named Star. Um, yeah, my whole family, they all st they still have like yeah. horses and they all live very close to each other in right. un sector que it's called Los Colones, uh -huh. which is my, my last name is Los Colon, mm. because it's like family lands and it's, you know, like that. And it feels like going back home every time, literally. You know, in El Barrio, in Philly, también tenemos una, we have a, um, a really, you know, concentration of Puerto Rican and mm. Colombian and like that. That same swag that they have over here in Miami, yeah. they just, you know, they have winters and stuff. You right. know what I mean? <laughs> right. and I grew up speaking Spanish first, yeah. in fact. My, I'm very lucky to say that my grandparents are here with me still Beautiful. today yeah. um, and you know when you're when you're a family that's an immigrant family you know a lot of the times it takes a whole village to get the to keep to raise the kids so sure. they played a really big role in my upbringing mm -hmm. and I, I heard stories of Cuba I heard stories of their upbringing mm -hmm. I learned tongue twisters in Spanish yeah. and I sang songs and I learned about flavors th through that lens so it's 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 indelible it's everywhere good night Miami I am Dramos my dogs are barking, but South Beach is calling my name. I'm about to go have myself a whole nother night here in Miami. Thank you so much for tuning in. We'll catch you next time.